Norway is one of the first options when considering a work visa. A rich and growing economy with high standards of living makes it a great destination. But do you know the work visa rules? Watch this video till the end to know it all. Hi, this is Behnam from the Visa Library. Here, you're about to learn all about Norway work visa. Before I begin, subscribe to this channel and hit the bell. You shouldn't miss any updates. Don't forget to download the free cheat sheet for a Norway work visa from the link in the description. It's helpful along the way. Now, let's begin. To work in Norway, you're gonna need a work permit. So, first, you'll have to find an employer who is willing to hire you. Prepare a resume and look for job on websites that advertise job positions in Norway. Websites like Randstad, Jobs in Oslo, The Local, Finjobs, Indeed Norway, and other ones. You can find more websites in the Visa Library article from the link in the description. When you found the offer and signed an employment contract with your employer, you could apply for a work permit. It's also mandatory to fill out the UDI's employment offer form. You can find the link for the form in the description. At this stage, someone has to apply for a work permit. It could be the employee or the employer. But if the employer is going to apply, a consent letter from the employee is needed. Let me tell you this. If the employer applies for the work permit, the process will be speed up. The employer needs to apply to the Directorate of Immigration website. The application begins there. You can find the link in the description. If the employee is going to apply for the work permit, he or she must apply to the Norwegian Embassy. The authorities need some supporting documents. The employment contract is one of them. If the employer applies, the employee needs to send some documents to him or her. The point I should explain here is that a work permit is an authorization to work in Norway, but a work visa is permission to enter the country. It takes some time until the Norwegian authorities decide on the work permit. When they issue it, a big part of the process is done. Now the employee needs to apply for a work visa. At this stage, you got to collect the list of supporting documents for a work visa. You could begin gathering them a bit earlier to save time and speed up the process. Are you wondering, what are these supporting documents? Here is a list of them. Number one is your passport. It must be valid over the date your employment contract. Also, it cannot be older than 10 years ago. Number two is a copy of your work contract. Remember one point, it must contain the exact details of your employment. Duration of employment, your salary, perks and bonuses, working hours, and everything else. Number three is completing the online application form on the UDI website. When you complete the online application form, you will receive a PDF application form. You gotta print this form, complete it with your information, and then submit it along with the other documents to the embassy. Number four is your CV or resume. Your CV or resume is needed to indicate that you have relevant work experience. It also says that you can do the job you have applied for in Norway. Number five is your educational document and certificate. It could be one of these items. 1. Certificate achieved through work experience. 2. Educational degree achieved through a college or university. 3. Diploma or certificate of vocational training for at least 3 years. It must be at the upper secondary school level. Number 6 is a photo. Two photos of yourself is needed. They must be fresh, taken in the past 3 months. Yes, 3 months, not older. The background must be white and clear. Remember one point, the veil, hat, sunglasses, weird mustache or beard cannot cover your head. Number seven is the accommodation proof in Norway. Your future employer could help you with this. You need to make it clear where will you stay while you get to Norway. You can provide a rental agreement or reserve hotel proof. This was a general list of documents, but there will be more. When you complete the UDI online application, it will provide you with a checklist of supporting documents. When you're done gathering the supporting documents, schedule a meeting with the Norwegian Embassy or Visa Center, VAC, responsible for visa processing, 
in your home country. The UDI website tells you where to apply in your home country. You can find out how to schedule a meeting through their website. Get to the center in person and submit the supporting documents. There is always a fee for visa processing. It's about 5,400 NOK or 589 US dollars, but you might have to pay more. Ask the center how much the visa costs you and how they will get it. You gotta pay the visa fee through a credit card or transfer it to their bank account. Remember to keep the receipt. When you're done with the visa center, wait for the processing. It takes time until the embassy issues your visa and they will inform you as soon as it's ready. When the visa is stuck on your passport, you can move to Norway. Now, how long should you wait for a visa processing? The point I'm gonna tell you is that there are two processing times. One is the work permit that the authorities in Norway issue it. The second is a work visa that the embassy or visa center issues it. So you gotta wait two times for a response. You'll receive an answer in 6 to 8 months at most. Your work permit is valid for the duration of your employment. It's often about 1 to 3 years. But you can extend it as long as you have an employment contract with the Norwegian employer. You must live a few years under a work permit to become eligible for PR or permanent residency. If you want to bring your family to Norway, you need to apply separately to the UDI and complete an application form. The link is provided in the description. The two nationalities that are into working in Norway are the Indians and the Pakistanians. They have to go through the procedures I explained here and then apply to the Norway Embassy in New Delhi and Karachi. The other question you might have is a job seeker visa. Is there such a visa in Norway? There is no Norway job seeker visa. You must have a job offer to apply for a work permit. But you can apply for a Norway tourist visa and enter the country to look for a job. Remember one essential point. You have no permission to work under a tourism visa. The consequences of breaking the rules are harsh. You always have the option to look for a job through the websites I have provided you in the visa library article. I also introduced the most in-demand jobs and famous companies. You can get familiar with working conditions in Norway as well. All right then. This was all that you need to know about Norway Work Visa. If you have questions, write them down in the comment section. The Visa Library team will answer them right away. If you want us to make more videos about Norway or its visas, just tell us in the comment sections. We'll get you what you want. Before you leave, subscribe and download the free PDF file for the Norway Work Visa. It'll help you a lot. Stay tuned. Thank you all for watching.